Okay, this is CS235, final project, Jonas Forsland. Jonas, please tell us what you have created here. Uh, created a, a haptic device in the style of the famous uh, Phantom. Uh, and uh, so it gives you uh, force feedback in three dimensions. Okay, show us what the, what the different joints are. So the different joints, you have a first, first have a turntable. Okay. And then we have um, two other cable drives. All right, so we've got three cable drives. So three cable drives. Okay, yes. cool. Now let's look at some haptic interaction. Yeah, and we have some turntable with some points. We can poke around and we can feel the forces. Okay. Cool. Okay. Now could you please show me the gravity compensation? Yeah, so if we leave it... It, it is, if you turn it off, it falls down. Yeah. Okay. Um, so it's, cool. it's a bit heavy, but when we, if we start an application... Can you show me the camera? So Jonas has plugged in his custom haptic device to the Chai library, so he can just load arbitrary models and manipulate them as if this were just a phantom he bought off the shelf. And let's see that active gravity compensation again, just because it's so cool. Phantom don't do that! There you go. Well done, Jonas. CS-235 final project presentation, Jonas Forsland. He has a three degree of freedom haptic device. He's giving Synthball a run for their money. He did this in three weeks and has it hooked up to Chai. Now Jonas, take your hand off for a sec. It's not falling over. That's active gravity compensation right there that you can't get in most devices. So go ahead and interact with the, uh, the model. Now Jonas has very high forces, it's a very stiff mechanism. Now he's formerly HCI, but I think we may have converted him to mechanical. We'll see. He did this in three weeks, it's really quite impressive. And so let's just take a look in here. So we have two cable cap stands driving these. Then we have a cable mechanism in here. And then we have this base cable mechanism and you can see the tensioning of it. So this is, uh, Jonas, what fraction of money do you think this is compared to um, a desktop phantom? What fraction of what? What fraction of cost is this of a desktop phantom? Well, uh, I don't know the electronics. Uh, I'm guessing four or five. Yeah, this is very nice. Do a little bit more interaction for me. And can you do the O-ring? Yeah, the O-ring uh, example. Do you have any other models? Do the camera. Camera. Check this out. So Jonas has it spinning. Pull. So he's interacting with the pool balls. Excellent work, Jonas. Can I see the active gravity comp again? Perfect. Look at that. So he's not fatiguing his hand.